Hello guys, welcome to another short video on Bootstrap. In the previous video, we have seen how we can add model using Bootstrap in our web page. As you go on developing websites, there might be a complex situations or scenarios where you want to control this model pop-up using JavaScript. So there is a provision in Bootstrap to control this model pop-up using JavaScript. So let's see how we can control this model pop-up using JavaScript in Bootstrap. Let's go back to the code which we have written in the last video. Currently, as we can see here, we are controlling open model functionality using these two attributes. So let me delete these two and if I scroll down, we have added close functionality using this attribute data dismiss. So let me remove this one, save this file and go back to our web page and refresh. If I click on open model, as we can see here, we are not able to open model. To control this one using JavaScript, first let's add uh, IDs for this open and close buttons. For open, I will add ID as open button. Similarly, I will add another ID for this close button. That is ID is equals to close button. Let's add JavaScript code to control these two things. So let me add script tag. So first I need to add click functionality for open and close button. So let me add this one. First for open button, I need to add click functionality. So let me add function. Within this one, I need to control the model. So as we know, we have given ID for this model, that is my model. Using this ID, we can control on click of open and close button. So whenever we are clicking on open button, we need to open this model for that one. So on click of this open button, using jQuery code, that is using dollar hash my model, then you add model functionality. So this will allow us to open the model on click of open button. So let's save this one and go back to our browser, refresh and if now we click on this open model, as you can see here, model pop-up is getting opened. Similarly, we need to add functionality for close. Go back to our code editor, copy this click functionality and paste it here. Now we need to add functionality for close button. In this model functionality, just add hide. Save it and go back to our browser and refresh it. And if I click on open button, it's getting open. And if I click on close button, as you can see, it is getting closed. So now we are able to control this model using JavaScript. So thanks guys for watching this video. Please click on like button, share it to others and subscribe to my channel.